questions about it. Yeah, you know what, Deirdre, at this point, I'm going to say it's going to be a dry marathon. If anything, there'd be some rain showers developing later on in the day into Sunday. Meanwhile, though, we do have our own storm system lining up right now. In Stockton, Port City waking up to 43 degrees, so another morning we're finally above the freezing mark. You can think the cloud blanket overhead, partly cloudy skies around the Port City. Southeast winds are pretty light right now, just about 8 miles an hour, and it is going to be a dry commute around Stockton, Modesto, Turlock, and Waterford for the morning on this Thursday. Lake Tahoe, look at this. Pretty mild morning by Sierra standards. 49 degrees. We have a strong southerly wind up to uh, 20 plus miles an hour filling in from the north shore to the south shore. That's bringing that temperature up, but we're expecting that temperature to head down through the remainder of the day as this cold weather system comes marching across the Pacific and eventually moving on shore. Right now, the only rain we have featured on Doppler is right off the northern coast of the state, and eventually that same band will march its way across our area as we move through the afternoon. Now, it is going to turn pretty wintry in the Sierra pretty quickly. I especially think that as we get towards 11, noon, and into the late afternoon, that's when those heavier snow bands are expected. We do have a winter storm warning, which will go through Friday morning. We're calling for four to eight inches of snow above 5,000 feet, up to 15 inches around those pass levels as we go through the overnight tonight, and the winds will be strong and sharp. You're already getting a taste of that early this morning. Looking at the big picture, here is that weather system. Again, the same line will come moving from the south to the east as we go through the remainder of the day. And what we can expect around the valley floor is anywhere from a quarter of an inch of rain to maybe a half an inch in some spots. Best timing for this right now will likely the rain starts to fall around noontime. I think out towards the delta or the coast, you may have showers starting up as early as 10 or 11 a.m. But other than that, I think most of us will see the widespread rain by noon today. Strong southerly winds will accompany this storm, 15 to 25 miles an hour with gusts up to 30. And as mentioned, the Sierra snow will mainly be a little higher up than previous storms and mainly 5,000 feet plus. So today in the Sierra, prepare for the winter weather. If you're trying to travel in or out of the mountains, do it sooner rather than later as that snow comes falling down later today. Highs in the upper 40s to low 50s around Pollock Pines, 58 today in Sonora. Most of the rain will fall today in the foothills along with those sharp winds likely in through late afternoon and early evening. And as mentioned, out towards the coastal range, San Francisco, Napa, and Lakeport, your rain may start up as early as mid-morning. Around the San Joaquin Valley, kind of waiting on the rain as we'll expect those lines to move through right around noon. Farmington, Escalon, Oakdale, get ready for the rain later this afternoon. Highs in the upper 50s around Marysville. So our temperature is not changing all that much from yesterday. The big thing changing will be those wet and windy conditions through the afternoon. Wind should taper off after sunset tonight as the rain wraps up as well. Next chance for rain, as I mentioned, late in the day Sunday, possibly a few showers in the Monday. Right now it's 520. We'll check in with Jacqueline and see.